radioactivity, contamination, toxic rivers, chemical pollution that destroy the life of the ecosystem and of every being that populates it. If you take the folk of Muslimovo, you realize that especially young people are not well. Testimonies of those who survived. A trip with director Alessandro Tizei, photographer Pier Paolo Mitica, and researcher Michele Marcolin in one of the most polluted places on the planet, the province of Chelyabinsk in Russia. A zone of ecological disaster. Inaccessible areas where even breathing can be lethal. The province of Chelyabinsk in 2013 made national headlines because of the meteorite that fell in this region. It has been one of the main centers of military industries of the former Soviet Union, in particular for the production of nuclear weapons and tanks. Historically used as a nuclear waste dump, it is classified as one of the most contaminated areas in the world, with levels of radioactivity far higher than those found so far at Chernobyl and Fukushima. Timotei was born in 2001, and as soon as he was born, he was diagnosed with cerebral neuroparalysis. No one explained to us the reason for this diagnosis, but they said the reasons could be several, and that one of them could be my parents who were victims of the accident of the Tay River in 1957. We live on the third floor. He grows every year and it becomes increasingly difficult to go out. We don't go out for walks anymore, partly because the city doesn't have services for persons with a handicap and people aren't used to seeing handicapped people around. 